I was just about to cross the road and this guy called me and said, hey, hey, man, hey, man. I'm like, what's up, man? Why is he calling me? He said, I'm Yoruba. And I'm like, how? You're Brazilian? African Brazilian. So to him, he believes that his ancestors came from Nigeria. So he's telling me he's Yoruba. You are, you are from Yoruba? See, yes, yes. yes. Ah, have you been to that? Yoruba <laughs> How did the Yoruba culture even get to Brazil? Bahia is a state in Brazil that was declared the Yoruba capital of the Americas by King Oni of Ife because of the large numbers of Brazilians that practice Candomblé. Candomblé is a religion in Brazil. The people devote their time to worship the Horishas, the Yoruba deities. Yoruba is a language that is widely spoken in Nigeria mostly by the Yoruba people. This same language is spoken by some Brazilians and taught in some universities in Brazil. Some Brazilians claim to be part of the Yoruba people and they believe their ancestors are from the Yoruba land. These people are so committed to the Yoruba culture that they study and practice everything about it the divination, sacrifices, prayers, and incantations. Whenever the Yoruba people have their religious festival, the Brazilians also celebrate theirs in Brazil. Some even travel to Nigeria to experience the origin of the culture. How was the Yoruba culture able to spread to so many people in Brazil? The culture was brought to Brazil during the transatlantic slave trade. It was developed among the Afro-Brazilian communities during the 16th to 19th centuries when millions of enslaved Africans were taken to Brazil. It started through the blending of traditional religions brought to Brazil by enslaved Central and West Africans, the majority of them from Yoruba, Fon, and Bantu. They established themselves and practiced the religion they brought from Africa. The people united in Bahia region during the 19th century, following Brazil's independence from Portugal. Today, so many Brazilians are fully part of the culture. Enslaved Nigerians are not lost in Brazil. They lived and left a mark, thereby showing and teaching their children and children's children everything about the culture and tradition they left back at home. Ore.